Hello, good evening. Good evening, sir. Good evening. I I bring in all the wishes and greetings to you from Speed Medical Institute on behalf of all the faculty members to Dr. Vibha Kumar Singh for scoring uh, topmost rank uh, in MCH Neurosurgery Specialty in NEET SS 2021, rank number 83. Thank you, sir. Thank you. And uh, great accomplishment, and uh, very happy to interact with you at this forum. And we want to know something about Dr. Uh, Vibha Kumar Singh. Sir, uh, I did my MBBS from SRMS Bareilly in Uttar Pradesh, and uh, then I did MS Surgery from Subharti Medical College, Meerut, Uttar Pradesh. And why your surgery? sir uh, actually in uh, internship of my mbbs so uh, i was posted with a onco surgeon so i was just very thrilled by the uh, so i he once took me uh, for the first time i went into a general surgery ot with him and i was very thrilled in that that thing uh, for that thing only i have prepared and uh, did surgery sir so i always wanted that thrill in my work <laughs> so then uh, you should have uh, also had an option of cardiac surgery right uh, sir cardiac surgery actually sir neuro surgery because i did my uh, ms during uh, covid time so in final year it was a first wave of covid so we are we, we were post i was posted in neuro surgery at that time covid time and okay. Uh, our rotation stopped uh, when the hospital converted to covid and all that so our rotation stopped so i was stuck in neuro surgery for 7 months okay <laughs> so the place where you stayed little long i think has captured you and inspired you yes, sir. so uh -huh. sir uh, i was stuck for 7 months and then at the end of 7 months i was independently doing edh and sdh and all that so i was very happy with neuro surgery and i thought In NEET also, sir, I just opted only one single option. That was neuro surgery. If I do neuro surgery, I'll do only neuro surgery. That's it. <laughs> Nothing else. Great. Now we want to know your uh, strategy and your uh, plan, methodology, how you prepared, and uh, can you share something on that? Sir, I uh, started preparing actually after passing my final exam in uh, 2020. I passed my final exams and then I joined as a SR in. a medical college and started preparing for initial 5 uh, 4 5 months sir uh, i was working and preparing working and preparing then i thought but i was always a very mediocre student so how how do you say that i mean where you get this uh, terminology from please don't take me wrongly how, how where do you get this terminology from the mediocre student that terminology how where do you get it i was never the topper of my class or never you know i was almost you you tell me one you tell me one answer for my question do you need to be a topper to become a surgeon no sir then not at all hmm? so, surgeons don't like to read correct <laughs> right sir. they like right. to operate right sir right and huh? so i i request I mean from now on okay sir. to not to use uh, that terminology for yourself mm -hmm. yes sir sure being a surgeon itself is great yes sir always the king of the institution always the king of the hospital <laughs> yes, sir. yes come on let's go so initial 4 5 months i i joined uh, speed at the end of my uh, final paper i joined speed and then uh, initially for 4 5 months i was only uh, listening to videos of vijay sundaram sir and uh, satish sir and natrajan sir and take took down notes so after 4 5 months i realized that i am not giving sufficient time to studies so i left my residency and gave full time to the preparation of so this was like 5 4 5 months before need ss paper but then uh, neat ss got postponed so i was in i don't know i started questioning that uh, did i took the right decision dropping so many months will i get something or not and all that but i continued my preparation your 
in that time your uh, you know sir uh, the pattern changed and all then you posted your videos on youtube that was very inspiring sir and so so that i'm even speed extended my membership and all it was very very you uh, know the way you changed and added a whole group for that new pattern so it was very quick and that two months were very helpful sir uh, so i i was not focusing very much on general surgery i was initially i was reading only neuro but then the pattern chain i was like struck by this so <laughs> so so that time i all gave almost 16 hours per day to only general surgery and special classes by onco surgeon and euro surgeon and all that so that helped me a lot in my general surgery part so then pattern changed again and then sir uh, at the end i was just reading my notes and i uh, gave all the grand test that were in neurosurgery part almost 12 13 grand test were there and part completion test and all that that was it was very helpful sir so at the end good good ending yes sir it was it is fine i think good fine good so did you read any textbooks sir initially i uh, read uh, i uh, took up bailey for general surgery part but then it was very time consuming so i left reading and only focused on videos and notes that i made from those videos at the end i only revised from notes even sir uh, there was a pdf sent by your team of that general surgery uh, question and answers so i print uh, took a print out of that pdf and added my uh, notes to uh, that book only so that was helpful sir that was helpful okay very good doctor i am really glad that you took time off to share all your uh, experiences and the people who are watching in this video will definitely be benefited out of it and uh, once again uh, i bring in all the wishes to you thank you and sir. to have a great career thank in you, much, neurosurgery and keep going and best wishes thank to you, you. thank you thank you, thank you.